Hello, today I'm going to be showing you guys what I did for my bridesmaid uh, thank you presents. Um, I got married recently in July and I wanted to do little thank you cards along with a gift for the wedding day. Something that the bridesmaids can use and we can take pictures in. Something that was similar for all four bridesmaids. Also, I wanted to get something for myself. Um, so what I did is um, online they have necklaces, they have bracelets, they have earrings, but I was like no um, If they wear their hair down, you won't be able to see their earrings and Necklaces the neckline of the dress that I chose or that they chose for themselves Didn't show off their neck. So a necklace wouldn't be a good idea A choker would just be too much too modern. So I decided to do these dainty cute bracelets. I did the rose gold for them because their dresses had some rose gold accents to them. I decided to do the silver for mine. There was also gold but I decided to do the rose gold since the dress had some rose gold to it. And I did the silver for mine because I have a white gold engagement ring and wedding band so it just looked nicer for it to all matched and i was gonna also i used it so you can see my ring from here and it just would look funny if i had a rose gold along with my girls i just decided i am the bride i'm gonna go ahead and do this um, silver um, that would go well with my other jewelry that i was going to be wearing that day and these little pillows that you see where the bracelet is on i actually made that it didn't come with it it came just by itself and it didn't it looked kind of like uh, like i don't want to say cheap but it kind of looked cheap and just to make it look prettier and put it more of a glamorous look i decided to just to tissue i put it in a little ball little square and taped it around and that made it more presentable especially since it was going to be a present but yeah right here you can see how both colors look on my skin tone you have the silver you have the rose gold um, and there's my ring so you guys could see what it looks like um, but yeah what i did is the day of the wedding i put them in little boxes i had my girls wear some robes i will be leaving the link on the bottom that showed you guys um, the robes that i chose for them i put in a cute little floral bag and then i gave them this bracelet along with a thank you letter letting them know how much i appreciated them and for their work that they had done um, just for everything you know the bridesmaids do the bridal showers do the bachelorettes and um, they get to plan a lot of things and i'm just thankful that I, I was able to get some help but yeah these are the bracelets and they're great as a thank you uh, for helping me out um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel rosie's reviews for any upcoming um, i'm going to be doing videos on some of the projects i did for the wedding and just other reviews from amazon things i have bought so stay tuned and don't forget to hit the bell to be notified um, for any upcoming videos you'll be it will alert you if you hit the bell and I will be leaving any links and if you have any questions or anything about the wedding day or planning for the wedding let me know I will be more than happy to help you guys I already got married July 7th so I know a lot of the planning I did it myself didn't have a planner so I enjoyed it and it was a lot of fun um, so yeah let, let me know I would say the only downside of these bracelets is that it does dangle and it is cute when you're wearing it because it, you know, it, it brings attention and it's just a cute bracelet in general. Very, very, you, you can't really feel like you have it until that little clingy, that little thing that's hanging um, does get caught on stuff. So that is the only negative, that it does get caught on stuff. But other than that, I do recommend it.